Oh, these look delicious. Delicious. Mmm, delicious. I've just had a bite and it's delicious. Delicious. Yep. Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is Monday the what? The 20th? 20th of November. It is Black Friday week. So I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed and stressed. But luckily, we have a spa day today, don't we? We are on our way to the Champneys. Is it called? Do you pronounce it like that? Champneys, Champneys um, Spa Hotel at Mottram Hall in Cheshire. You've been to Metro Mottram Hall before, haven't you? Oh, oh, it is a really, really popular wedding destination, which is why Jacob's seen before. He's been to a wedding there. But they have a full hotel, spa, spa facilities. Um, you can get treatments, etc. And that is where we're heading off to now. It is five past 12, so we'll probably get there about one-ish. We're gonna check our bags in, because I don't think our room is free until 3 p.m. Potentially it'll be ready a bit earlier, but I'm not sure. Um, so we'll probably just give our bags in and then um, go and enjoy some spa facilities. It's actually a gifted experience, so I'm very, very thankful and grateful to Shockneys for doing this for us. Um, we're also gonna have dinner this evening and breakfast in the morning, and then obviously um, overnight stay at the hotel. So um, yeah, I'm, I can just hear you chewing on your nails. I hope you couldn't hear that. Believe me guys, Jacob is getting on my last wick today. All week she's been doing my head. All week you've been doing my head. I don't even want to go to the spa. Should have invited somebody else. Um, but yeah, that's the plan. Um, like I said, it's Black Friday week. I'm going to purchase a new camera, guys. She's not. I am. She's not. I am. I'm gonna purchase a new camera and I think I've changed my mind. So I was gonna get the Sony ZV-E10. Now I think I'm gonna get the Sony A7C. Just been watching some vids on there. The only issue with the Sony Z7C it is already more expensive than the Z Sony uh, ZV-10, but it's a full frame camera. So, it's going to be like our camera for a long time if we get that one. Do you get what I mean? I don't trust you. Well, I'll show it you, but if you have any good vlog cameras or you watch a youtuber and you think oh i really like her vlogs and the quality of her vlogs and you know what camera they use or video camera blah blah then let me know because it's quite difficult to choose i really wish somebody would just say courtney get this camera it's going to be the best for you but i don't know how to do that also in the works i spent a good couple of hours um yesterday evening um pre well attempting to pre-plan because i'm potentially going to attempt to do vlogmas this year which is so scary and again overwhelming but i think i'm just gonna do it i'm not sh i've not decided whether i'm gonna do every other day which really isn't vlogmas maybe i'll just do like 12 12 bits of christmas something like that or just to go ham and do the whole of vlogmas i've tried my best to pre-plan as much as possible and um come up with like a posting schedule but i think i'm only up to like day 17 and i'm running out of ideas guys so if you can leave in the comments down below what you would like to see throughout a vlogmas that would be very much helpful and we'll go from there and obviously i'll keep you in the loop with what i end up doing whether i end up doing every other day posting for in december or every single day in the lead up to probably like the 21st because knowing me i'm always super last minute buying christmas presents etc so then last couple of days before christmas day i am manic so i'm probably only gonna do vlogmas up until the 21st anyway but yeah that is the poa let me know what you want to see and um yeah i'll get to post them jacob's an absolute toddler 
Yeah, mm. and he's hungry, so... Starving. How hungry? On a scale of 1 to 10, like, I would say a 9.6. 9.6 out of 10. I'm pretty hungry as well. Uh, we're literally around the corner from Mottram Hall. Cheshire's just so pretty. If you didn't know, Cheshire's like the... But it's the upscale of the Greater Manchester. The nice place in Greater Manchester, isn't it? Sure. Yeah, it's probably the nicest area in like the Greater Manchester area. Um, and it has so much... We're basically in the countryside right now. Um, and we've driven past the farm shop. And I was like, let's stop there. Um, I saw a Molly Mays vlog that... Um, she goes to the Holly's farm shop. You're gonna want to go there, babe. It looks lovely. Really? Honestly. Um, but we've gone. What? Which? What one's this called? I don't know. Uh, um, Brooks, I think. Yep. Yeah. Brook Bro House. Brook House farm shop. This is my new bag. Isn't it cute? Let's go. Delicious. I want some of these. Pretzel things. Yeah. Sesame, yeah. No. These ones? Yeah. And then sour cream and onion. Two. Yeah. Just for the room, you know. No. <gasps> Babe, look at these. I've got some Babe, look at these. Delicious. Oh, and get me some milk chocolate ones. Oh. Yeah. What about these? No, not chocolate one. What about that thing? Done. Yeah. Eight quid on pretzels. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then there's a little cafe back here. Hmm, what do I want? Oh, I want some banana and chocolate well. Oh, look at them in pies. I have got time for hot food now. Um. I've not got time for hot food. No, I don't think so. Oh, I could just get a lot of food. Why are you getting this chicken and veg pie? Or um, cheese and onion pie? I'll get a I want, can we share it? Can we share it? Oh, let's eat hot food, babe. Look. So minty lamb chipper. Yeah, I want that. Mmm, delicious. What's chicken hash? Don't know what chicken hash is. Great days until the plan is Okay. Sit Let's sit down on this little cute. This one? This one? Wait, 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 wait. Do you mean wait? You're not going to turn it around to me. I am. Okay. So first up, we got the banana loaf. I've just had a bite and it's delicious. Jacob, you have a bite so you can tell them. Mm. <laughs> They've given us a mince pie to try again. Jacob's never really tried. He's never tried a mince pie. Or he's, he's, up in the he's not tried um, a mince pie since he's younger, and he doesn't think he likes them. So let's see. That's so weird. Why? So weird because it's what it's got a weird taste, but then it's quite nice. I don't understand it. Delicious. You get what I mean, don't it? 
Like it's not just sweet, it's something else in there that's sending me off. It's the fruit, it's the raisins. No, I love raisins, but they're wrong. It's not raisins that I can taste. Orange. So, to reiterate, we got sickly. No, they don't. They're Moorish. No, they make me feel sick after a while. Really? We, oh, I need to put my belt on. We got sour cream and onion pretzel thins. Multi seed sesame pretzel thins and then milk chocolate covered pretzel thins. We've just opened and tried those. They are yummy. Let me tell you. Ignore the state of me. <laughs> We've just left the spa. What time is it, babe? Six, six. Half six. Half six. We just checked into our hotel. Uh, into our room, sorry. So, I need to show you because it's honestly unreal. So, here we have the front door. Then you come in. How freaking nice is this? Look at that giant ass bed. Go and sit on the bed, babe. So, they can really really see the size what in the world and then from here we have the bathroom we have a bath how nice I'm honestly so happy thank you so much Champneys you smashed it oh and the bed's comfortable isn't it um so it's currently six. Plan of action. Well, no, it's half six, isn't it? Half six. Half six. Plan of action is have a bit of a sit down for ten minutes, and then we need to get ready because we need to go to dinner. Our meal is booked for half seven. There is an on-site restaurant called the Carrington Grill, I think it's called. I imagine that's steak and stuff, which I'm happy about because I really want steak. So that's why we're eating this evening. Um, so I need to get ready. I'm a bit worried that we don't have a hair dryer. <laughs> nope. I knew I should have dried my hair. 
in the spa. Disaster. Absolute disaster. But anyways, I will check back in once I'm all ready because I don't know what I'm going to do with my hair. Potentially just scrape it back now. Yeah. Have to do. Apologies for this. What? Such a low angle. There's not really anywhere else I can put you in here. We have literally got like 10 minutes to get ready. So I'm just doing my like super fast go to makeup, which currently is just um, Falls Filter in my contour areas. Tiny bit of concealer in just dabbed in with my finger under my eyes and where I need to cover in. And then I go in with the pink honey face frosting and a brush just to contour a bit more. By the way, I didn't even tell you we had a massage. I booked it for us and it was unreal. It was so so good to be honest we we got um a deep tissue one um and it was quite painful at points at points i was thinking to myself whoa mister because it was a, i had a mister i was like whoa mister that elbow was going a little too deep there i could just feel him bouncing off the bones in my back so at points I was thinking, well, should I have got the deep tissue? Probably not. I don't know why I always put it on this side of me. Because I actually much prefer my left side. You know when people say, oh, I, that's my bad side. I never knew I had a bad side. And now that I've realised that this side is so much uglier than this side. How weird. How crazy is that? Um, sorry, I've just went in with, this is so old, it's lasted me forever, it's literally how much I've got makeup on. The Charlotte Tilbury Glow Wand, is it called? In Glow Gasm, I think the colour is called. Now I'm just going to dust off the areas that I've contoured with the Charlotte Tilbury, um, what's this called? Airbrush Falls Finish Powder. I used to bake all the time my face with like my Laura Mercier and now I've realised I actually don't like to bake anymore. Is that weird? How can you go from baking to completely not? But that's what I've done. And then I've just bronzed with the airbrush bronzer in the shade 3. This is actually a tad too dark for me. Um, but hey ho. Now I'm going to lip line with... Again, Charlotte Tilbury, I might as well be an ad for Charlotte Tilbury at this point. Um, in the colour Pillow Talk Medium 2. Medium 2? 2 Medium. This, again, is not really my shade, it's a bit too pink. See what I mean? It's very pink. Very, very, very pink. But, it's okay. I don't hate it. And this is the Beauty Cop Respond... Responder Beauty Crop Mascara and it's called Avo Cuddle. And I've been having real issues with mascara at the minute, not being able to find one that doesn't smudge underneath my eye, and this one doesn't. So, if you're looking for a mascara that does not smudge, this is the one for you. Just got it on top of my eye. And then I'm going to spray my face and then I've just realised I've not put anything through my brows so I'm just going to go through my brows with the Fluff Up Brow Wax by Benefit. Sorry for the really super loud fan in the background. That is the final look. Um, just need to get changed. Okay guys, the fit. I have these jeans from PLT which are way too big. So I did the loop trick where you hook the button through like 
the loop on the left and then just join them together. I hope you know what I mean. But they are a super nice jean, but they're just a tad too big. Then I have these ankle boots from Zara. Can you see? I got them last weekend. Well, last week. So, so nice. And then this little grey tee you always ask about is from Weekday. And then my Zara bag is from Zara. <laughs> I've just topped up my lips with some lip balm. We're going to be late for our reservation, so let's head off. In fact, we are late. It's one minute past, um, so we need to head out. Apologies for the wait, sometimes it's hard to... <sighs> Come tell the vlog how the food was. 